The first set that we're going to take in the grid is going to be a quick set. That's a pick it up, put it down. So if Coach Raff's working out of a left-handed stance, that quick set is determined based on the cover down alignment. All right, the defender, as a base rule, you want to stay inside, in front, thick and square at all times. The quarterback is positioned inside where Coach Cunningham is. All right, this is the position of the defender. He just did, simply needs to pop set or what we term quick set. He's going to pick that foot up and put it down. All right, you can see his feet are on railroad tracks. He's in steel rod position. So as he sets, he is inside and in front. He is thick and square. If that defender were to work inside, he can post to a post step to maintain his position, which we're going to talk about. That is a quick set. It is a firm, aggressive set. We do not want to get our dashboard pushed in. So we want to stay thick and square, stay inside and in front. Stay inside and in front, stay thick and square. And you don't need arms to block people if you understand position, all right? The next set is what we term a negative set. And we already worked it over here. So if Coach Raff, if a guy was on the inside shade and Coach Cunningham is again the quarterback, that negative set is a slide step to get to what position? What did I call it? Stay what? Inside and in front, stay thick and square. Okay? That negative set. If we're slide protecting this way, and Coach Raff knows that he has help coming from his inside, a negative set is a firm, aggressive set to his gap side. It turns into man once a guy is presented in your gap. The third set that we're going to do is what we term a 45 set. So the more width, the defender has the more depth you are going to get in your set so again he's in a hand to foot what we term loose alignment as coach takes a 45 set okay don't overset me yep. just take two okay set go all right right there he is now inside and in front to meet me at the junction point the point of contact the contact zone so i'm meeting him at an inside and in front position all the time to protect my inside half to the quarterback. Go, right there, as this guy rushes up the field, he's in 45, he works for more width, he's maintaining that inside and in front position. This is his kick step, okay? And this is his slide step. So kick step at a 45 degree angle, slide step cuts the top of the grass, the toes are always pointed straight ahead. Okay, they could open a little bit, but once I get duck footed and these toes are open in this position, hips and shoulders open up. Okay, we stay closed out and we're in position. I'm always gonna be in a squared position to utilize my weight room power. Okay, so we have quick set, negative set, 45 set. That defender has more width. Okay, if coach were to take a quick set, set go. Is he inside of me? Yeah. He's inside of me, what is he not? In front. In front. Okay, if he took a 45 set with this width, set go, he's off the ball, he's inside of me, he's not in front of me. So it's all about position and your footwork is based on the alignment of that defender. Okay, so as he's got more width, we term this a mid set. Again, the wider he is, the more depth I get in my set. Set go, there's a mid kick. He is now in position where he meets the defender at the junction point. That straight line, right, the quickest point, way to get between point A and point B is a straight line. He's met at the junction point. Once we meet at this junction point, he's sinking his hips, squeezing his knees together. He's ready to take on the blow to lever charge of that defender. Okay? The more width he had, I said the more what we do with our set. The more width, the more what? Depth. The more width, the more depth. Does he need to get a bunch of depth here? No, how about here? Nice little 45 set. He's out here, mid set. The wider he is, the more vertical. So if I drew a straight line as a wide nine alignment to Coach Cunningham on a seven step drop, this is the position that he needs to be in. This is the contact zone. If he steps laterally on a 45 set, he's gonna get beat to his back shoulder all day long. So as he 45 sets out wide here, there's no way he's going to get beat to the back shoulder. So it's imperative that you understand 
what the alignment is of your defender, what the protection scheme is, and how am I going to meet that defender at the junction point. That's the straight line. He wants to rush up the field, you just stay vertical and wait till he meets you at the junction point. Okay? I got width, I got depth, set, go. Okay? And as soon as he dictates shoulders at me, he's now to an inside and in front position. Okay? Those are the variety of sets that are taught at every level.